Hello and welcome to The Basics, a multi-boxing adventure. We are here in the plane of knowledge. T today we are going to uh, buy our level 15 spells. Last episode we uh, hit level 15 in uh, Gina uh, after a extremely massive pull that I thought we were going to lose the cleric on, but we uh, all pulled through. So what we're going to do is buy spells and get all of that configured it should be faster than the uh episode that we you know we bought spells last time instead of picking up we already have all the macros kind of set up we just need to move the spells around and do that so just a matter of getting all that done and uh let's go ahead and sort by skill level and see what we actually get here um i think i already bought that one right <laughs> yeah all right, so we picked up fear, not as useful anymore. Summon corpse, not as useful anymore. Uh, new pet, and a new uh, life tap, and a new uh, uh, what are they called? I think it's an ACD buff. So let's go ahead and scribe all of these. Come on, there we go. We got a new pet. I'm not gonna bother with it personally, but uh, if you like doing it, go for it. I don't. All right, we're going to put that life tap in for the new one. We're going to put Scream of Hate in five. And we're going to want Clinging Darkness on our bar somewhere. But that should be good. So we're going to go ahead and save this as main. Save that. And we're going to take a look at this. We got one, two, th four, <laughs> four, three, three, four. So let's do this. Three, four, and cast five. Now, I don't think it'll really matter uh, the way we got it. I don't think it'll ever cast some of those lower ones because they'll refresh in time. Uh, but it doesn't really matter. I manually cast everything on this character for the most part by hitting alt plus whatever number so not a huge deal for me personally um and we don't get any of these till 51. all right so shadow knight is quasi taken care of so he's got life spike on that that should be fine and we're gonna put we'll just yeah we'll leave that the way it is for now all right, so next is the cleric, and a lot we do had uh, we had like sixty something platinum uh, from our split uh, from the items we sold in the last episode. So they all have money. Uh, we just need to go buy all their spells now. There we go. So we sort. Um, I don't have any on here. So Invis Undead, he got it at eleven. Uh, endure disease, sensed summon, hollow of light, or halo of light. There we go. There's our first resurrection spell, which uh, will help us. And I believe all that does is bring you back to your corpse. No, uh, no experience in that one. All right. And a new armor class buff. Nice. Go. So for the most part, I don't think we got a heal. Let's go like right here. So Invis Undead, Since Summoned, uh, Resist Buff, Halo, Spell, Undead Nuke. I don't even know what that is. I don't know what that is. The Res, Endure Cold, Spirit Armor, and what is this other one? Blessing of pi pi Piety. Alright, so let's drop Stun. Let's put Blessing there. Let's drop Holy Armor. Spirit Armor there. Let's drop Ward Undead. And let's put Smite right here. Uh, we don't have these in our cleric's macro at the moment but uh 
I like to just have them memorized right now since we don't have any other spells to like put in the place of them. So it's not a big deal. And then I had already purchased a symbol at one point in time. And piety, uh, I believe it's spell haste, yeah. So that's pretty nice. So we got that. So Shadow Knight, Cleric are set. Now who is this? This is the Enchanter. She's down here. So as I as I said, it'll be a lot quicker of a video. <laughs> uh, we shouldn't have to change anything because all the all the behavior we want is kind of set up, right? So it's just a matter of getting this configured. So we get charm. I'm still not. Uh, I'm not. I I don't like charm. I if I was playing just enchanter, charm is a different story. But since I you know doing what I'm doing, charm. Unless they changed it, breaks all the time, and just really annoying at this level. All right, we got a new mez, which that low that level low mez didn't really work very well. And that's why I kind of stopped using it in that last dungeon. But I think we're good. Oh, we got breeze. I didn't. I thought that was level sixteen, but it's level fourteen, so that's nice. Got a new pet. is to undead another enchant a lot of enchantment stuff barbarian oh we got haste i don't know if i'll be casting that more than once illusion tree and uh levitate so let's go ahead and memorize these so we did get some spells that will change the behavior of how uh this character will work so we'll have to tweak those real quick I'm probably going to drop the dot from her rotation right now, and I'll just leave the nuke. I think that's probably going to be like our best, uh, best bet. So if we go here, right, yeah, quickness, identity, breeze, uh, new pet, lots of illusion spells, lots of enchanting spells. So there's a lot of those that just add to the cost for, uh, enchanters all right so uh let's drop let's drop ebbing strength and that was cast three so let's just take this out of uh out of the picture for now i'm not even really even casting that anyway so this is going to be enthrall this is going to be this is actually going to be permanently breeze. This is going to be summon pet for right now. Just get rid of him. And so we got, got a new dot anyway, so we're going to go ahead and keep that. I think that was kind of clutch in our... Uh, Defeat, defeat of that uh, <laughs> that uh, massive pull uh, because we were just like completely tapped on all the other characters for mana. Uh, chaotic feedback. That looks about right. So let's go ahead and resummon our pet. If we don't move. There we go, and then uh, haste. And I guess I could just go ahead and put that cripple back in here for now. Save that. Perfect. That'll be that'll be her lineup. Uh, choke will be the new our new spell. We'll cast that. Uh, What's my macro for that? So she casts Choke, which is a three second. So we're gonna add, add a second to this, or half a second. Uh, actually, let's make it four. And then the other ones are the same. And then she now she has a new Mez, which uh, is a 2.5. Let's add a five to that. And a four five to that and cast six just in case we fizzle 
how we can uh, kind of recover from those a little bit easier. There we go, perfect. And uh, I probably should go ahead and save her spell set as main, just in case I mess around. All right, so you're good. I forgot to save the clerics. Save that as main. All right, now to the mage. So the mage is over here. All right. Here, this little gnome. All right, sword by level. All right, we finally got a, a, a buff for the pet, right? Uh, we didn't have that before, so that's going to be a lot better. Summon Elemental Defender. I don't even know what that is. Find Definity. A Phantom Armor. So we get some pet armor and stuff like that. I don't know how useful that is at this level. It could be useful. It could just be total waste of, waste of time. Uh, we'll see. I might mess around with some of this stuff. And see, so we got a level 15 new summon uh, fire elemental. I don't really like the fire elemental, so I'm not going to use that. Uh, but I am going to go ahead and pre-buy the air elemental for level 16. Because uh, we're going to get 16 real quick, and uh, we're going to want that. All right, so that is all our spells. Let's go ahead and get these described up. Calm of Fire. So it looks like we got a new air elemental, so that's probably the one we're going to go with. I think that's going to be like a level uh, 10 or something like that, maybe 12. All right, so we got that one there. Okay, so let's look at the pets. We got a level 12 air. Level 15, level 14 water. Let's go with water. Uh, water is a rogue, so it'll do a little bit more damage. And I believe it backstabs. I don't know if it backstabs at this level, but uh, <laughs> we'll see. All right, so uh, I guess she lost her pet at some point anyway. So let's go ahead and summon another one. All right, so let's go magic nukes here. We got shock blades is still our best magic nuke. Our best fire nuke is shock of flame. So that is 122 damage for 48 mana or uh, 42 damage for that. Um, I'm gonna go with the fire damage. We want things to die faster is really what we want, so we're going to do all this to two. It would probably be easier just to swap the spell slots, but uh, I'm actually going to make a separate key at some point for uh, the different nukes so that it's easier to uh, deal with. So we got our new pet. Let's go ahead and buff that pet. That's something we're going to have to start paying attention to. Uh, did we get a new damage shield? No, we did not. That's fine. Okay, mage is good. Now for the wizard. Uh, where are we at? All right here. So hopefully the wizard gets something cool because <laughs> I need big damage out of him. Is really what I need. I need I need mobs to just die as fast as possible. That's our goal. So let's go ahead and get all these. Doesn't look like anything special yet. Uh, I really want to get the lesser evac uh, spell. Because that's something we just really need when we're dungeon crawling. And uh, I don't remember what level that is. 15... Lesser evac is 18. So, all right, let's 
memorize these ones and see where we're at because there's a, a few I think I missed because of the lag. And the same thing with this guy. I'm just going to change the button for now, but I'm going to make these into uh, uh, cold fire and magic nuke buttons. Uh, I'll probably just do that offline because uh, it's kind of tedious. All right, so we got all of the spells. So let's take a look at what we actually got here. I didn't really look at them before. All right, so it looks like we got a new fire nuke. So let's take a look here. Direct damage, fire, flame shock is our best one, our highest level one that is. Uh, we got a new shielding spell. Let's go ahead and memorize that. We also got shield skin, which requires a cat's eye. So we need to go buy some cat's eyes. Uh, let's look. I think we got a new lightning spell or magic one. No, that's not one. Do we get a new cold one? No, we didn't. So we only got the new fire nuke, so two. So all these can be changed to two for now on. And we'll cast the fire nuke. Like so. And then this is a 2.5 delay. So this needs to change to three. That'll give us a 3.5 uh, second delay between casts, which should give us enough uh, time for the spell gem to refresh. All right, let's go ahead and rebuff our shielding. And so we should be nuking uh, 175 now. Uh, so that is... Uh, that's. That's phenomenal damage for this level, right? If we had three wizards, I think it would like one shot anything we we were fighting at this level. So, all right, let's run you up back to the group, and then I'll have to breeze everybody and stuff and uh, whatnot, and do all the buffs. All right, and last but not least is the Beast Lord. Ah, uh, she's running the wrong way. So. She, I believe, gets a new pet from what I looked up, and uh, I believe she gets her first nukes and stuff like that. So she's going to be a little bit more uh, involved in setting up. So let's sort by level. All right, Fleeting Fury, Blast of Frost. There's our first nuke. Spirit Lightning, I think that's a pet proc. Sicken, Strengthen... Uh, pet heal, new pet, and I think we're good there. All right, so what do we got here? We got minor healing in our first slot. That's trash. Um, nothing at the level you get minor healing is worth it unless you're like sitting there doing nothing. <laughs> it's just not worth the effort. All right, so let's drop uh, that pet. Let's get this pet. And I guess I lost the pet. I don't know what happened there. Uh, so those are all the next tier. Nice. Okay. So let's go here. Pet heal. Level 15 pet heal. We're going to want uh, pet miscellaneous buffs. Spirit of Lightning. Um, take a look at that here in just a second. Once it's refreshed. Let's get that pet going. And Spirit of Lightning. So fills your warder with lightning. Increasing their dexterity as well. Providing them a chance to do a lightning attack. So this adds a lightning proc to our pet. Uh, should do some nice damage for us. And I don't see anything else. I guess we could put Sicken right here, just to maybe as a way to get up the skill for Conjuration over time. All right, so here we go. Um, hmm. Let's do a cast one right there. 
That's about all we're going to be able to fit into that macro. So let's go here, assign social right here. Uh, spam two. Make this there. So pause five, cast assist main. Um, we're going to then pause, I don't know, 50. I don't know how long, what's the cast time on this thing? 2.5. So 30 comma cast two. And that should be fine. Uh, cast two again, just in case we frizzle and that should, uh, that should allow us to dot and we'll uh, have that dot also on uh, the enchanter. So the two classes will be able to uh, dot when we hit that. And the enchanter only does her thing on uh, four anyway. But the uh, Beast Lord should be locked into this one. Uh, the two macros do not coexist at the same time. All right, so we got a new pet. Uh, we got Breeze now for everybody. We got Haste. Um, it's a very manual process um, to buff everybody. I, I could probably make macros to go and individually target everybody and do that, but I'm not sure how how uh, how much effort I want to put into that right now. But only. Uh, Everybody only needs Breeze, really. So, um, I can do the rest of that later. Uh, so there we go. Uh, that's our new spells. All our macros should be set up. Um, and next episode, we're going to head back to uh, Najina. Try to get level 20. Uh, once we get level 20, we'll go to Franklin and hit him up for whatever the daily zone is go knock that out and then we're gonna hit soul a in uh the following episode that is my plan uh and then i should put us about like 22 for soul a and we shouldn't be able to start killing goblins by then i should have uh shrink i believe <laughs> 22 or 23 uh, shrink on the Beast Lord. Let me double check that. I want to make sure I'm saying the right thing here. Uh, at 23 is Shrink. 24 is Spirit of Wolf on the Beast Lord. So that'll give us that. And then I believe the Shadow Knight at level 20 gets the next Snare, which the snare is going to be a very important spell in soul a so uh, about level 20 to 24 will be in soul a doing that uh we might stick around in Nigeria Najina a little bit longer but uh i'm not 100 percent sure how long i'll stay there the experience is so so uh but uh it is fairly easy so uh thank you very much for watching and have a fantastic day.